Math describes everything. Begin with height, weight, shoe size. You just start right there. There's a tremendous amount that you can get from that particular bit of information. You begin with one piece of information and you take it and you assign it a set of rules or a set of values. The radius is right here. Generates all these smooth curves. All the designs are, he does everything mathematically. It comes from his engineering background and from his snowboard experience. Coordinates of all sorts of different things. So in the very end, we have over here the X and Y coordinates for the, the side cut. I'm a math geek, I love math. And you can boil so much of engineering and design down to a model of numbers. And to me, that's the coolest thing in the world. A lot of other manufacturers kind of do things differently. Everything we do is you know, based on the spreadsheet. We've looked at other snowboard manufacturers drawing circles and lines in order to engineer their snowboards. And a snowboard, to me, is so much more than a group of circles and lines. I find that the Donic boards have an awesome character. It's really snouty around the gates, and I can get the turnaround. Geometry is for just the tip and tail of the board. So you're still getting this great custom features and all these things that you would get from somebody who hand shapes and custom makes a board, but you're getting repeatability. You're getting consistency. You're getting parts that fit together perfectly every time. Well, yeah, the precision that goes into it is just strong. It's his passion for mathematics, his passion for snowboarding, and kind of how he's found this niche to make both those things work to create a great snowboard.